Where did you say you found it? I opened the cigarette box and there it was. And you say the gun is not yours. I told you, I never saw it before. Be at my office at 10 o'clock in the morning and bring that gun. Now, who is Harry Merrill? I don't know. You'd better tell me because he's lying at the bottom of Sunset Canyon Road with a bullet through his head. A bullet from a 38. Now, this is a 38. A man by the name of Harry Merrill was killed with a gun like this. I bought two guns like it. I keep mine in the glove compartment of my car. Is it there now? I don't know unless I look. Would you look? I distinctly remember putting it in the glove compartment. Now it's gone. It must have been stolen. You took it from me, left the room, returned, and gave the gun back to me again? Yes. Was it the same gun I gave to you? No, it was not the same gun. I contend that the fatal bullet came from another gun. Your Honor, the prosecution knows there are two guns, identical guns, both bought by the same man. Is there anyone else in this courtroom who's rented an apartment from you? Yes, sir. Him. I only saw him three times, but each time he was hanging around Miss Bagby's door. Promised me $500 if I'd make trouble for Evelyn Bagby. But he didn't pay me. What did you do? I figured it out. I killed him. I get the money. <laughs>